this LMB can get damaged by lightning. We can have an LMB with the, the this paddles damage and the water get inside and get damage your LMB. As we know that the LMB is very important in our installation, without LMB, we cannot have our signal. And when the LMB is damaged, we need to replace the LMB. If we want our installation to come back to normal, we have to check this LMB to find out if it's damaged or not. How do you check your LMB? You can check your LMB by doing a physical check. You may find this part which is actually damaged. And when it's damaged, the wind and the water will get inside. That is a physical check. You may find that your LMB is cracked completely. For the body, it's not that damaged, but the very important side is this one. You got a hidden LMB fold. With the hidden LMB fold, what do you do? You need to use either your multimeter to test the value of the resistance this side, or you use your signal finder, your digital signal finder. But on this video, I'm going to show you how to test this LMB with your analog satellite signal finder. Just this small device. How can you use this device will help you to test this LMB. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the channel of technician. Today, we're going to be talking about the LMB. But this time, I'm showing you how to test your universal LMB using your analog signal finder. Okay? Stay tuned to the end. To test your LMB, you need to have your decoder, which is going to be uh, connected to the power. You need to have your satellite finder like this one. You need to have two cable like this one. Two cable like this one. And you need to have your decoder connected to the power supply. Okay? I got my decoder here, which I'm going to show you. This is my decoder. And then I'll connect the power. I'll connect the first cable here and to this cable when i connect my decoder here the, the decoder come on the decoder is on okay i got the power and then i got this cable and from this cable i'll go to my signal finder always remember that on the satellite finder you got lmb and then you got receiver so from the receiver i'm going to the port written receiver and when i put it immediately because my decoder is on the light go on and you see the light go on inside hmm? the light go on inside from the decoder so one cable to the signal finder i'll put the other cable to this so let me stand up and show you normally so to test your signal you need to plug you need to plug on your decoder like this you take the part here you go to your signal finder like this one you go to the signal finder to the receiver port and out to the lmb you go to your lmb let's go to the lmb when i put the lmb my signal finder should make a noise okay so what you do you plug it on with 12 volt you take the cable from here you go to the signal finder you come from the signal finder you go to your lmb okay so when you connect this you're gonna hear this noise on the signal finder so how do you know that the lmb is okay you're gonna test the lmb now after you have the noise check the needle inside my signal finder and hear the the sound of the signal finder look when i do this can you see this the needle is moving and the, the the sound is, imagine is the wave of the signal was coming to this LMB. That's how I know. That's how I know this LMB is good. So if this LMB was not good, the needle will not move like this. And the, and the sound will not change when I put my hand like this. So this is the easy way to test your LMB using your analog signal finder your analog satellite signal finder so you can see you can do it by yourself you just need to connect from your decoder when the decoder is on from your decoder to the signal finder and from the signal finder to the lmb and then you can do this so what i'm going to do i have another lmb with me which is not working 
and let's see what's gonna happen. I'll just remove this LMB and then I'll remove this one. I remove this LMB and then I'll put another LMB, which I know this LMB is not working. So here yeah, what's gonna happen? I'm just putting this one. Just see what is going on. I never change the decibel on my needle. And then I put it till it making noise. Can you see? It's still making noise. But let's see if it's gonna change with the wave. You see? Can you notice that the sound is stay stable? The needle is stay stable. That's how you know that this LMB is not working. But you can see the LMB is looking fine. It's not broken, it's looking fine. But you may be thinking the LMB is still okay. But it's not okay. See? This LMB is bad. This LMB is not working. Because the sound of my signal finder is constant. The needle on my signal finder is not moving when I'm touching the front of the LMB. That's where you know your LMB is not working. Okay? Guys, if this video was so good for you, you know what to do. If you are happy on my video, let other people know. Subscribe. This is the channel of Technician. I'll see you next time. Call me Alphonse Foucault. We've got many types of signal finder, but this one can allow you to find the IS-20. And if you need this signal finder, contact me below. Send me a mail. Contact me. Below, you'll find my phone number. My WhatsApp number, you can contact me if you need this. I can deliver this signal finder anywhere in Africa.